In this video, we will explain how to use the Lead Tools Master Forms Editor demo to create and edit master form templates and categories, add and edit text and OMR fields, and use forms processing to extract the data from filled forms. First, let's examine how forms recognition and processing works in Lead Tools. Most enterprises and recognition centers have a wide variety of forms that are used on a regular basis. Therefore, the first step within an automated system is forms recognition or classification. Lead Tools employs multiple recognition engines for classifying forms and compares various elements such as text, structure, and barcodes to uniquely identify a template document. Lead Tools will compare an incoming document against a repository of master form templates and report back with a match. After a form is matched with a master form, the fields are then processed to extract text, OMR, barcodes, and images for entry into your database or business logic. With the workflow of Lead Tools Forms Recognition and Processing explained, let's dive into how to set it all up using the Master Forms Editor demo. Lead Tools includes the Master Forms Editor demo which greatly simplifies the creation and organization of master form templates, repositories, and categories. First, we will load and examine the example master form set that ships with the toolkit. As you can see, the repository has several master forms, each with a single or multi-page image with fields defined around the blank areas which will get filled in by the customer. Now we will create a new repository or master form set. After selecting the folder, give the set a name and it will create a new subfolder based on the set's name. The Master Form Sets folder contains all the necessary XML, data, and image files associated with the forms. Once a Master Form Set is created, you can start adding forms and categories. Here, we are adding our first form and giving it a name. Now, we will add a child category, which can be used as a subset of master forms within the current master form set. All forms within a child category will be compared at the same time as forms in its parent master form set, but not vice versa. This provides greater organization as well as faster recognition when the child category is known. A popular use of child categories is for multi-page master forms that share the same first page but have different sets of subsequent pages. When setting up a form, it must be given a blank, unfilled image against which filled images will be compared. We will go into greater detail regarding the form fields in the next chapter. Any master form set can be saved and loaded again for editing. Let's open the default OCR master form set again. Then we will load our new set, which contains the child category within it. Finally, let's load just the child category, which exists as a subdirectory underneath its parent master form set. To demonstrate drawing and editing fields with the master forms editor demo, we will use the OCR example set that ships with the SDK.
The W9 form is missing fields around some of the text areas we wish to capture, such as the social security number. Since there is a bar separating each portion, we will create a text field for each. To improve the accuracy and speed, we will set the text type to numerical only since we are not expecting any alphabet characters in these fields. Now we will create optical mark recognition or OMR fields for the checkboxes. LeadTools OMR is flexible and accurate under any situation, accounting for discrepancies in how the field is drawn. It can automatically detect whether the field was drawn around the frame or only inside of it. If you have a preference for how to draw the fields, you can manually tell the engine what to expect. Now we will process a filled form against a set of master forms using the Lead Tools Forms Processing Demo. You can select any master form set on your machine or network. Here we are selecting the default OCR set which we modified earlier. Now select a filled form and the engine will clean and pre-process the image prior to classifying and processing the form. As you can see, the form was correctly identified as a W9 with a confidence of 98%. Furthermore, the new fields we added were automatically found and their values extracted. The data grid view lists the fields along with additional information such as confidence and bounding rectangle. Double click on the field to see the detailed character results dialog which shows the confidence and bounds of each character in the string. When a field is selected, a highlight annotation is drawn on the large viewer on the right and a cropped image of the field will appear above. Thanks for watching. We hope you enjoyed our presentation of the Lead Tools Forms Recognition and Processing SDK and how easy it is to create, edit, and organize master form sets with the master form set demo and process filled form images. For more information and to download our free 60-day evaluation, please visit us at www.leadtools.com.